Hi guys, I'm Phil Sturpey. In this video, I'm going to show you how to resolve the error no signed drivers were found when trying to install Windows 8. Yesterday, I attempted to install Windows 8 on my new HP EliteBook computer. I intended to dual boot the machine with Windows 7 and Windows 8 and had already installed Windows 7 on the first partition. It was when I tried to install Windows 8 that I ran into trouble. I selected a custom install option in order to choose a partition to install to and received the error message. No signed drivers are found. Make sure that the installation media contains the correct drivers and then click OK. Not only did I receive an error but there were no partitions listed in the window. Naturally I searched for the error message online but unfortunately most of the suggestions had to do with corrupt or dirty installation media. I was pretty sure that my media was fine. Fortunately, a colleague suggested it might have to do with the secure boot settings in the BIOS. This is a security requirement for installing Windows 8. I searched HP for guidance on preparing my computer for secure boot and found a page that instructed me to simply download the latest driver for the BIOS and install it. I followed the link and downloaded the BIOS driver for Windows 8. Once I'd run the driver and rebooted the machine, I tried to install Windows 8 again. This time when I selected the custom install, I was presented with a full list of available partitions and was finally able to install Windows 8 without further problems. There you have it. In this video, I've shown you how to resolve the error no signed drivers were found when trying to install Windows 8. Thanks for watching. Please feel free to comment and suggest more video topics. Most of all, don't forget to subscribe to keep up with my videos as I release them. Bye for now.